Hello, everybody. Andrea here with Dental L. So if you are a dental hygienist in Ontario, you have to complete your self-assessment before January. And you do that online. I'm going to show you how to do that. And I'm going to show you how you can tell if you've completed it already, because this actually happened to me. I forgot I had completed it and I was going to do it again, but it actually says complete. So yay me. So let me show you guys how that works. So I'm going to share my screen. I am logged into my actual smile portal. Okay. So if you're not sure how to log into your smile portal, let me know. Um, it's just kind of through the CDHO website, but you have to click like log in. If you need help, let me know. But I am now in the smile portal. If you guys look, I'm going to zoom in here. The upper left-hand side, you see how it says self-assessment year 2021. It is complete. So make sure this says 2021. Mine says complete. Make sure yours says complete. If you haven't done it yet, it's obviously not going to be complete. So let me show you. For year 2022, I just changed that. It takes a second to load. Notice how it says in progress. Notice how self-assessment is due January 31st, 2022. So this is the one you need to work on. If you click 2021, you would have done that already. But 2022, which is next year, obviously, this is what you have to do. But a lot of hygienists forget. And they think if they click on the current year, that's what you have to do. But if you do not fill it out, you will be audited. When you're audited, that means you have to submit either your portfolio or take the quality assurance exam. Who wants to be audited if you don't have to, right? So let me show you how to do that. So self-assessment, mine says in progress. So you need to verify a bunch of stuff. So you basically have to go through everything first once again. So click this. Um, actually, guys, on second thought, I'm going to cancel out of that because I don't really want to show you guys my personal information. I'm sure you understand. So you have to click through all of that. OK, so I'm going to do that and then I'm going to show you guys in another video. But you know what I'm going to do first? Let me share my screen again. So what I did was I moved back to 2021 because I want to show you guys what it's supposed to look like. So once you verify your employment, so the upper left hand side here, once you verify your self assessment is going to come up. So that's number two. So you click on that. Again, you guys make sure it says 2022. And then this is when you would submit that. So you would click on this form. I'm just going to click that quickly just to show you guys. And then you just kind of go through and fill out all of this. Okay. So that's it. Do it now when you're thinking about it. Okay. I'm going to hop back and show you guys in another video if you're confused on what you have to fill out first, but just go log in, make sure it says year 2022 at the top um, and verify employment. And then the second one is going to open up. Do it now while you're watching, the, well, stop the video and do it now so you don't forget. It's so easy to forget. Probably 50% of hygienists forget and then they're automatically audited. Nobody wants to be audited automatically. So do it, you guys. I'm going to leave the link for you down below. For Ontario dental hygienists who are audited, I can help you. There is a Facebook group for dental hygienists to network, ask questions. I offer courses. I do offer help um, for the portfolio, the practice profile, self-assessment, all of that. So feel free to have a look, you guys. I'm here to help. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.